If you're in the Amazon book business, Amazon KDP, and you haven't heard about this Chrome extension, you are wasting your time. Let me show you, especially for those of you who are making Amazon uh, books with AI and children's books, regular books, coloring books, all the different types of books. If you don't have this Chrome extension, which basically fills out the entire Amazon form, which as you can see over here on my screen over here, what you're seeing here is the Amazon KDP form. Now this is absolutely huge. There's so much work to do. And I bet that some of you get people, you hire people to fill these forms for you. But what if AI could just do this for you entirely? So let me just show you how it works, the form, uh, sorry, the Chrome extension. And then uh, you'll be happy to know that it's free to use. You only use it per book once, which basically means you pay a couple of credits per use and then it will do all the work for you. Now, for those of you who don't already know, we are generate.net. We create books. Uh, we, we have apps that create books, whether it's uh, children's books, coloring books, regular books, short stories, comic books, etc. You name it, we have it. So for those who don't know, welcome for the first time. Make sure you subscribe. You, If you are in the Amazon KDB business, you do not want to be unsubscribed from this channel. This channel is the book. Basically, most of the content on this is about AI tools. But this, but we have mastered the book creation process all the way to the form filling. So let me just click on the KDP extension uh, over here, right at the top. Once I click on it immediately, what you'll find is that it opens up and then it tells you what is your book called. Now, based on your book, it will be able to create a subtitle for you. And then you can choose your default names, which will then be used to create the description and everything else. But before we start this, make sure if you build the book or create the book using our platform, all the information is going to be inside the system. So if I click on generate subtitle right now, what you're about to see is it will automatically create a fantastic subtitle for the book. Now I've already set my default names here so they will be saved permanently and as you can see there's an intro which was already generated by the book creator. Um, I can create a new description just by pressing this button here and it will then just create the description, a brand new description for me over here. You give it a few seconds, it really needs to read the whole book and think of all the information. Here we go, fantastic. Just remove these little uh, issues at the beginning and end. If you see any HTML, just remove it. Then this is the magic part. This is the part all of you will be waiting for when you're creating an Amazon KDP book and you don't want to waste too much time, especially when you're dishing out a lot of books with the key phrases. You just press this button once and that's it. Children, emotional health books, books about feelings for kids. As you can see, this is the kinds of keywords that you'd expect people to search for if they're looking for this kind of book. Then you click automate KDP listing and watch this. All completely filled in. Fantastic. All you need to do yourself is the categories. Now this works for regular books and also for eBooks. So we have not forgotten about eBooks. Thank you for watching this video. Make sure you get this extension. I'll leave a link in the description for the extension. Uh, so you could just download it directly. You do need an account, but all you need for that is an email and a password, and then you're in. So thank you for watching this video. I was Daniel, your host. Subscribe to never miss more tools, which will speed up your Amazon KDP workflow. Bye for now.